Hey y'all, welcome back. Well, today's video is going to be on a product that we stumbled across down at the Tennessee Outdoor Deer Expo, the Rendezvous in Lebanon, Tennessee. And I uh, got to talking to uh, Pat Newcomb of Newcomb Hunting Blinds. So uh, we're going to be using them during deer season and for sure during turkey season. But it's a really cool product. He's got a real good vision on what he's come up with. And uh, we're going to get right to showing you uh, how this thing breaks down and what it does. And uh, grab and go hunting blind. Now, this thing is super lightweight. It weighs literally nothing. It's got a strap on. You can carry it in. It's a perfect situation if you're turkey hunting and you're running and gunning, going back and forth. This thing really comes in handy because you can set it up in just seconds. Basically, you just pop it out of the bag that quick. You just look for the bottom, which now this is setting it up the first time. When you're hunting, you won't be doing this. You already have it in a position of where you can. It's got a tent pole style stake on the bottom. Same way here. Put them together like that. Now that's going to give you the bottom. Then you put the sides together just like that. And you have a blind. Now you're not going to put this one together just yet because at this point you have a perfect shooting stick. You can carry this. It can help you hike up hills or whatever to get through what you need to do, knock spider webs or whatever out of the way. This thing is super handy. As you can see, if you've got it wrapped up and you're walking through the woods with it, you can lay your gun right there. It's perfect. So that'll come in handy with, you know, whitetail hunting or mule deer hunting, whatever. But anyway, we're going to show you, you just open this thing up. You're going to make one adjust, one quick snap together, and you have a blind. Let me show you. This blind is ready to go. You can move it any way you want to. It'll cover you, conceal you from the angle that you're at. And if you need to run and gun and pick it up, you can actually just flip it. Pull that loose, and you're ready to go. So I'll show you Pat's video on uh, the Newcomb hunting blind, and uh, you'll see for yourself, and we'll also tag his video at the end of this. Hi, I'm Pat with Newcomb Hunting. I'm here to show you our new grab-and-go hunting blinds. This is how our blind comes packaged. It weighs three pounds and 32 inches. You can throw it over your shoulder. We've got a carry-in strap, or you can tuck it in your pack. Um, it's a great way to pack it in, bike it in, if you want to go a long ways in the woods. This is the same exact line. I'm just showing you a different way you can move with it in the woods. Once I'm out in the woods and I'm hunting, this is my preferred method of carry because it's a lot quicker setup. And I'll show you both ways you can get it. So a lot of times, like I said, I carry it like this in the woods. You can use it as a walking stick or a prop. Um, a lot of times when it's rolled up tight, you can also use it like a shooting stick. So if you're out on, on walk and you're walking and you decide oh I need to get ready pop your gun in there you got a nice little brace if you don't want to put it right on there you just top of your hand it's great for a lot of things when I'm out walking in the woods sometimes I'm getting cobwebs with it kids are getting out of hand you're poking the kids with it you guys will come up with a lot of new things for this blind maybe you can teach me how to use it <laughs> this is our blind um, I want you to consider it more of a screen out in front of you in your typical hunting blind. You sit back from it, you're going to shoot around it just as much as you're going to shoot through it. You can adjust the height of the windows based on the width of the blind. So it's great for kids, adults, whatever. Um, you can do a one pole breakdown and roll it up. That's the long version I showed you. That's how you're going to move with it in the woods if you want to really get, get somewhere quick and know you can set up in seconds. You go out calling on a ridge, bird gobbles, you want to drop down and you're ready to go. Same with deer hunting. You want to make a quick move with deer hunting, you roll it up and you're on the move. Break it all the way down, it's still quick and simple. <laughs> you simply got a middle pole, folds right down. Then on both sides, the fabric folds right off and you have two poles. You simply pop the poles, fold it up, the other side does the exact same thing. That's how you get in the bag. 
So you can go from bag to full setup in about 30 seconds. Now some people say, you know, that's not enough cover. I want to need a little bit more, or I'm hunting with somebody. So if I'm hunting with my daughter, or a buddy or whatever, you can, that, please. you can get two. You put them side by side. Now keep in mind, you're sitting back from this bottom. So if Presley's sitting over here next to me, we're sitting up against the tree. Get your mind where you want to put it. It's like you're on the wood. Okay? That's her height from her windows. Now because I'm hunting with her, I'm probably going to let her shoot. So I'm going to put my windows down where she can see. But the beauty of the blind is, you're not just shooting through the windows. I want you to keep in mind you're going to shoot off the edges as well. And then if you ever need to move it, obviously with kids, you got to get her repositioned. you got an animal coming in behind you and he can't see you yet, bird gobbles or something, you want to get readjusted, it's, it's a state-free system. You pick up the blind, you move the blinds, and then you get the kid readjusted. Now, if it is real windy, I'm not going to lie to you, they will blow around a little bit. Most of the time your foliage holds it down, but we do have spots in the corners where you can carry some stakes and put those in the ground as well. <laughs> but it's nice and lightweight, it's really easy for kids to take out in the woods. Adults, check us out. We got a lot of new stuff coming out as well in the future. We're a brand new company. We'd love to see our new hunting lines out in the field. Remember one thing: don't just hunt them. I also want to show you the difference here. So we got two different colors: True Timber Strata and HTC Greens are two different colors. Our two different camo patterns we've got. Well, as you can see from the video, Pat shows how easy it is. It don't take nothing to put these things together and use them. They're perfect. You can put, you can carry two, set it up, two triangles, one on each side. It covers a kid. You can hide a camera behind it. Uh, these things are super handy. I mean, they are lightweight, compact. When they're all the way broke down, they'll fit in a the backpack. They got a sling you can throw over your shoulder. You can lay them down beside you. You don't have to worry about it when you're turkey hunting if you don't have time to put it up, but you can flip this thing open and be completely concealed and completely covered up, especially during turkey season. Deer season, if you're spotting stalking and you want to get in thick brush, you can open this up and get in it. If not, you can use it as a shooting stick for a long ways off shooting. We really are looking forward to using these blinds this year. So be looking to see these on Pine Life on uh, uh, deer season 2022 and of course turkey season 2023 so go check out pat go check out nukem hunting blinds and like he says don't just shoot them nukem as always god bless see you on the next video